how stress affects your brain. The everyday stress you face in life can eventually go into a state of chronic stress. At this point stress will begin to change your brain. Being overworked, or having arguments at home, can affect the size and structure of the human brain, as well as how it functions. Stress starts in the hypothalamus pituitary adrenal axis, and a series of interactions take place between endocrine glands in the brain and the kidneys. When your brain detects a stressful situation, your hypothalamus pituitary adrenal axis is instantly activated and releases the hormone cortisol, which primes the body for a fight or flight response. This is how the body responds to stress. High levels of cortisol over a prolonged period have a notable effect on the brain. Chronic stress increases activity among neural connections in the amygdala, the brain's fear center, which results in heightened cortisol levels. This increase can cause electric signals in the hippocampus, the center for learning, memories, and stress control, to deteriorate, inhibiting activity in the hypothalamus pituitary adrenal axis, and weakening a person's ability to control stress. Excess cortisol levels can also cause your brain to shrink, particularly the prefrontal cortex. This shrinkage is due to loss of synaptic connections between neurons. The prefrontal cortex is the part of the brain that regulates behaviors like concentration, decision making, judgment, and social interactions. Cortisol may also cause the hippocampus to produce less brain cells, which could make it harder for you to learn and remember things. This can also set the stage for more serious mental health problems, like depression and Alzheimer's disease. There are many ways to reverse what cortisol does to the brain. Exercising and meditating, both help a person become aware of and focus on their surroundings. Decreasing stress levels will increase the size of the hippocampus and improve memory. It is very important to take control of your stress before it takes control over you. Thank you.